Hello everyone, I'm your host Andre and in today's tutorial I will show you how to build the left and the right side of the x-axis. So for the left side we will need these six acrylic parts. Now let's start mounting them. These parts should be like this right here. You must be very careful and leave this little part on the left side like this because if you want then the sensor, the red board and stop sensor won't fit. Now we will need 5 M3 16mm screws and 5 M3 nuts. Now we will need a lead screw, 4 M3 12mm screws and 4 M3 nuts. We will mount it this way. So you gotta be careful so this longer part will fit in here, like this. So we mount it this way, so the longer part is right. Now we will take a long box type slider and 4 M4 12mm screws. Now we will take a stepper motor and 4 M3 10mm screws Now let's take a pulley and uh, we must mount it with this part down, like this. Now we will take an M3 25mm screw, a black spring and a flange nut. We mount it this way. Now we need an end stop red board, two M3 10mm screws and two M3 nuts and we'll mount the red board on the motor side like this. So this is the left side of the x-axis, we will now continue with the right side. At the beginning we will use these three parts for the right side. We also need one M5 25mm screw, one M3 30mm screw and two M3 25mm screw. We'll take the M3 30mm screws and we'll put it through this. Now we'll take the M5. We 
Now we need six M3 shins, two M5 shins, and two rollers. And we'll mount it them this way. We we'll take one M5 shin. We'll put it here. We'll put three entry shins on each side. I will take this part and put it here. Now we need an other six M3 shins. And again, we'll put three on each side. And we'll take this. Part and put it up. Now we take one M5 nut and two M3 nuts, mount them. Now we'll take a spring, a black spring, and a flame nut, and this acrylic part right here. We'll mount them in place. Actually, we must put this one first. Now we need these five acrylic parts. We also need four M three sixty millimeter nuts. Now we need a lead screw, 4 M3 12mm screws and 4 M3 nuts. And as I said again, we will need to mount this with this longer side inside. Now we need a long box type slider and 4 M4 12mm screws. Now we have just finished the left side and the right side. So that's all for this tutorial, if you have any questions make sure to leave them in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video leave a like and please subscribe. Thank you for watching, have a great day.